Yes, right. Yeah. So, <laughs> so, so that's the same energy some project. So, so you are giving five thousand five hundred US dollars to this guy, and he's not reporting anything. So you just think, okay, something's wrong, and you know you should fail them. So that happens. So deploy and stick and maintain. So that's one thing. So reporting. So this reporting stuff, you can, you know, um, improve that skill. You can improve if you have that mailing list, which I told earlier, inside your community, and you start sending this daily status updates. So the more status updates you send, you know, it will be easy for you. Like in the current community which I wrote, that Igalia thing, they have a per hour based reporting, like every hour. Like uh, uh, we have our application called a PHP report where we have to type in like I started working from 10 a.m. to 12 a.m. and I was working on so and so and I have this so and so comments. But that's really nice. It's it's a certain kind of skill which might sound you know a bit you know astonishing to you, but but it really helps. Okay, like when you report daily, it, it will help you later when you are doing your masters, your PhD, your thesis, you are reporting to your mentors. Your lecturers, your professors, blah blah blah. blah, blah. So, yeah. no, I'm not mad. So I'm not mad. So starting early. So why you should start early? That's that's the thing. So uh, there are two conditions. Okay. So usually, uh, what happens is like you know when the TSOC application period starts, guys. Am, am I talking too much? Like, till what time do you have? Uh, Sagar. Five minutes. Five minutes. Come on, man, I got like a lot more slides. Okay, so I got just five minutes, so I'm gonna skip this. So if you haven't started early, you you are sure to have a tough time, which is of course true. Like you're going to an airport and you're just like half an hour before the flight, you are just gonna have a tough time. So you you you're gonna have a tough time to find project, and then you you'll have a tough time finding the vendors. So finding the vendors are like more tough than finding the project. I can assure you that. Because in my case, I got the project, but getting the right vendors was super difficult. I had to write a lot, to uh, mail a lot. Yes. So if you start early, you know people in the community already know you, right? Starting early in the sense you start by sending out some small, small bugs. So by March, almost like half of them in your IRC ch channel already know you, and they might be able to, you know, find this vendor for you. That's how it worked for me. Because my project was pretty complicated, it needed a guy from the operations team, and some of the community members just talked on my behalf to some of their mailing list, and one guy, Jeff Green, he's white, okay, so he 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 came up to help, okay, so and again, if you start early, there's this one attendance, you can come up with your own proposals rather than going up with some random random idea which the organization just proposed. So if you suddenly you can come up with your own proposals, keep, keep that in your mind. And organizations really appreciate it if you come up with your own proposals because we like it. So it shows that you clearly understand the project, you understand what is actually needed by the project. I'm going to skip it because... And once you complete your project, uh, deploy it, get into production and maintain it. Okay, so it's so like uh, after you project, like, like from my software. Then, you can blah blah blah, a lot of stuff, okay, interesting stuff which you can take back and go, go to your university and do all these things. Oh, we, we are running out of time. So, you can mentor for Google Code, which is like um, a Google Summer Code. No, it's like, yeah, it's like GSOC for 30 to 70 years age. So, if you have a sibling or, you know, if you know some kids who are pretty good with computers, you should tell them to participate in Google Code. So, these are like pretty small tasks and, you know, the students are like pretty nice. And they, they do a lot of stuff. So start a horse club in your university if if you want. Like that that would be cool. Like uh, like if you have a horse club, then you know a horse club can maintain this mailing list which I told, and you guys all can report to that mailing list, which is pretty nice. But it requires a lot of time, energy, and motivation, which is difficult. Then talk about your project in conferences, which is fine. Like, okay. So the and the new idea part. So this was the main theme of my talk. Guys, just think about it, how boring it was <laughs> if I just talked about this. So, this is uh, this is not like a pretty new idea anyway, but maybe uh, for the Wikipedia Foundation it might have been pretty nice. So usually a part which uh, exciting and you know, interesting students take is they participate for GSAT, they mentor for Google College and they the next mentor for GSAT the next time. But there's a can't. Like, um, 
how to get pretty good guys to participate in GSAL. That's one difficult thing which organizations really have to solve. Because the, the quality of the applications which we get are like kind of, like I can talk from the Wikipedia Foundation part, like it's, it's, it's depressing, like the, the quality is going down. I, I mean quality, not quantity, quantity we are getting lost, spam. But the quality is going down. There are some graphs in Wikimedia Foundation's wiki which actually show how many projects really completed and how many projects got deployed. Okay, so we were thinking of this thing, a new program. A new program which runs before Google Summer Cloud, which is like the KDE song, like KDE has... KD. Yeah, it's on KDE. Yeah, it's on okay. So we, we were planning about this and probably it will get deployed soon, I mean, but it requires a lot of organizational work. So if you have this new program running just before GSOP and it's not as selective and like, um, like maybe the organization never wanted to spend like two thousand dollars or something, maybe like KD Sock, I think it's it's, it's, free. it's, it's for the t-shirt and swag. So it's, yeah. it's for the t-shirt and swag and for the love of open source. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> okay. So maybe maybe we can put the same thing here. I, I think Wikipedia Foundation is super rich, so they can maybe pay a bit too. So. Uh, Maybe if this new program come up in between, uh, they can, uh, I mean, this can attract people like anything, like, you know, especially if you have a FOSS club and think about, like, say, such a program come in, like, everyone would have to, I mean, would like to participate. Like, FOSS issue is also having something similar, it's called Scott. I'm running out of time, guys. Sorry. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, so, uh, so these guys, so once they complete the uh, mentor for Google's coding, they can also mentor for Google Summer Cloud later and also they can mentor for the new program. So, you know, we, we can create a continuous cycle. That, that was what I, I, we were proposing in the Foundation's meetings and I hope it works out. Yes. So that's enough in us for today's disappointment. Let's talk more later today. Okay, so today evening, I'll, I'll be hanging around. I don't really appreciate cultural events, so we will be somewhere here. So we can hang on something. That's it. Bye.